Randy Van Patten here in the Drum Vault. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Randy Van Patten here in the Drum Vault. I just said that. Vansdrumming.com. I didn't say that. Uh, so, quick lesson. You can learn this in like 32 seconds, maybe 32 and a half seconds. Really easy. If you can do doubles uh, with your hands, double start rolls, you can do this. Of course, get tight with them. Be solid. Make sure you're in full control because basically it's going to be a roll between your hi-hat and your ride and then uh, your bass drum and snare go, jump, jump in there. So, uh, long story but short, uh, it, the pattern is simple and short. Right uh, hand on your ride, two hits, two hits in your ride, right, right, two hits in your hi-hat, left, left, and then a bass drum. Then you repeat that, two hits on your ride, two hits on your hi-hat, two bass drums, and a snare. And your snare can come from your right hand or go from your left hand. So, and it's a, it's a fluent, quick little pattern like this. So uh, basically, it's a one-time deal. The snare's coming down, it's gonna land on the, uh, the two or four, or the downbeat, wherever you wanna put that. And you could, uh, sometimes you can end it with your left hand on the snare and your right hand on the china, you know. Whatever floats your boat. So uh, an example of this, I will play in a, uh, a groove with the uh, upbeat on the right, and doom, bow, da, dum, dum, bow, whatever, something fun like that. Uh, your left hand sometimes is already going up here. If I'm playing a beat and it's an upbeat deal, if I'm not coming down on my hi-hat on one, two, three, four, I'm usually slapping it, whacking it, slapping and whacking, this sounds really bad. Whacking my hi-hat with my left hand in between, like, like so. I got too ahead of myself with my doubles. So the pattern will get thrown right in there. Here's the pattern once again. So you, you can see why you have to have really clean doubles. Or you'll be playing this groove at like. Okay, so holy cremoli is hot in here. I'm like dripping. Here it is in a beat. Take note, I just played it twice in a row. The second time, I did the old China snare whack. Do what you want, double up if you like. Here it is, double again, you know. And as I'm playing, I'm automatically doing this little slide up. I'm trying to do like, you know, uh, on, on the actual cymbal itself and then whacking the bell, you know. A lot of times I'm just gonna whack the foam. A lot of whacking going on here. Yeah. 